Speaking of nutty fringe, what's the testosterone <laughs> alert? And the alert goes to Tony Katz this week. So that Tony Katz dude, he's kind of a thing or something. I don't know. He, he's, he's a very big thing on the internet. And I love Tony. Because my favorite line is when people accuse him stuff, it's prove it. You know, you're not going to go up to Tony and sit there and make up stuff or say something that he did this or he's that or he did this or he that without you coming up with some proof on that. You know, and he's, he's cool. I'm sorry. He's just, um, I like listening to him because, you know, he educates you on some, mm-hmm. like you might know a little bit about something, but he gets into depth about stuff, the background stuff, so you have a better understanding of what's going on. And he's, for me, he's unique. Uh, I just, I find that. You know, I love his questions and answers, and he takes the mm-hmm. silly ones, he takes the ser- serious ones, but you feel included in his show. He's very good with the new media stuff, and he can put a very complex, overblown situation into a very uh, simple, a very simple metaphor that re- that you could use in any like situation. Basically, mm-hmm. he's just a little spazzy. Sorry, don't hate me. <laughs> <laughs> ah, he just likes to do, you know, the kiss style. You know, keep it simple. You know? Yeah. Mm-hmm. You and don't throws- have to. <laughs> and he throws chairs on CNN. <laughs> Not like I like CNN, but I mean, rawr. <laughs> that is really hot. <laughs> I have to admit. <laughs> One thing, I, Tony is one of the people that I, I try to listen to all the time because he does challenge me. And and I don't say that to a lot of people, but I, I even had to go on his Facebook and, and, and tag him on something and say, you know what you said today? I've not stopped thinking about it. And and. I don't do that. It's not a, you know, sycophant kind of thing. He really, you know, got an idea in my head and made me you know, fight with it. And and it was a uh, it was a uh, it w- it was something I was struggling with and I think he sort of eventually got me into a place where I could get some clarity over it. I like people who make me think. I think it's really necessary and, and it's difficult. It's part of why I'm a part of OTNN because there's so many brains, you know, around that, that you could bounce things off of. And and he sort of fits into that. I think that that I, I treasure him for that even. I, I like being challenged. Yeah, I really like Tony. I think he's... It's great how he really does support everyone um, in the new media, and he really likes to promote uh, other people's content. Like he's been putting my video on his show, uh, like using it as a commercial, and he also promotes like Kira Davis's stuff. And he's just a character. Oh, well, he totally. gave a beautiful shout out to OTNN the other day and having a discussion about, uh, uh, you know, the sort of legacy that Andrew Breitbart has, has left. And, and he pointed to, as an example, OTNN as a legacy of that and, and how, you know, a bunch of people just, you know, got an idea and ran with it and decided to, to build something on their own. And, and look where we are. We're right in the middle of one of the coolest developments in new media that there's been. You know, people are getting a whiff of what's going on. They're getting curious. They're coming to check it out. And, and we're right in the center of that. And oh, it's, it's exciting. And Tony was kind enough to give a really nice plug on his show about it and, and really praise what the guys have been doing. And, you know, who does that? He's so generous. You know, and, and part of, for me, he's almost fearless because, you know, look how, how much time is he on the road going to this event, this event, this event, and, you know, and, and talking to people and stuff. And, you know, and he takes us on, the, on his journey. You know, we get to, he'll sit in there and talk about his trip. Or, you know, while he's waiting in the airport, sometimes he's done his show from there. Like, that's awesome. He brings you into the conversation. <laughs> Absolutely. That's, an- that's another thing I noticed yesterday. I think his favorite phrase has to be engage a conversation. 
I need to start counting how many times in a show he says the phrase engage a conversation or let's engage that conversation or I was engaged in a conversation. game. <gasps> I was just thinking that. It, it. it comes up five our time. I can do that. <laughs> Awesome. Okay, I'm going to be so pickled the next time I'm listening. <laughs> yes, yes. We'll have was, our drinks ready. I was thinking the same thing. Oh. And and to be very fair to though to Tony, he really does, you know, engage. It, <laughs> really said it, but it, but the new media. I'm not going to say the phrase. Uh, he, he engages the, in the new media stuff very well. He can do a show, read a chat room, talk to Holly Bacon. And manage to take calls all at the same time. There's probably nobody who could even touch that except perhaps maybe Larry O'Connor. Maybe. Mm. Oh, so. yeah, he just doesn't just, have the hair. Right? Oh, yeah, we're going to hell for that. Control Tony has, ADHD. Yeah. <laughs> Tony has got it down to a fine art, you know, and it's impressive. I also have to say about Tony that, that one thing he did that touched me really deeply is he keeps talking about how the Tea Party is, you know, there's no national group that's controlling things. Groups are individually putting things together and, and in their local areas making an effect. And, and he really stands up for those local Tea Parties that seem to get overrun by national groups. And, and as a Tea Party leader here locally who's fought with some national groups, I really appreciate that he gives the credit to the local guys. Yeah, that is awesome. You know, and he's he's also very encouraging for people to um, step outside of their bound, their their comfort zone. You know, because he's talked about that. You know, how he got to where he is just you know just today, and and the the struggles and the journey that he's taken for that. And that's encouraging for people to to do whatever it is that they're capable of doing, and and stepping outside of their comfort zone. You know, and Tony does all this without you know getting a lot of money. He speaks for. Uh, for free in front of tea parties and he goes on his own dime to different places and and you know god i just wish him the most success with all that he's doing because he's really worked hard and earned it oh yes you can catch tony monday to friday on all patriotsmedia.com slash listen and then on saturdays you go to 97 one talk fm from five to seven central time and you can get as much tony as you can get and i recommend it and just while he has his shows on, he also has his chat room open. And if you know the OTN, OTNN people, you'll find them there. 